The Austin City Council is considering a proposal to partially reinstate the city's camping ban. That proposal was drafted by council member Ann Kitchen and co-sponsored by five others. It's called HEAL, or Homeless Encampment Assistance Link. It would move those experiencing homelessness from four high traffic areas into shelters. Those areas along East Cesar Chavez near Congress, an area east of I-35 near the Austin Public Library, along Menchaca Road and Ben White Boulevard, and at various spots near 183 in Northwest Austin. There will be no citations or punishments for breaking the law. If approved at Thursday's voting session, the city manager would return to council coming up. He would return to council in just a couple of weeks from now and have that approved. If approved at Thursday's session, the city manager would return to council in two weeks with a strategic plan and need to enact that by August. Now, council members are also considering separating the forensic slab from the Austin Police Department. If approved, $12 million and nearly 90 full-time positions would be moved from the police department's budget. Advocates of the move say an independent forensic slab means more transparency, support for civil rights, and for survivors of crime. A vote is expected on Thursday.